Hey, it's Captain Brian here. I'm going to take you for a walk through the woods. I've got my cool machete. Got something there. I love you, pink. Pink is unconditional love. Pink is literally me. It's in all of us. Again, nature is my church. It's what helps keep me grounded. I made a little TikTok video. I'll put it on Instagram later. <clears throat> but I made a little TikTok video that, um, A very wise person. Tell me about. And the basic says it's in books and it's everywhere else, but you know what? As I'm going through my process, I'm healing. I'm healing myself from my past traumas. Whether you believe me or not, I don't care. That doesn't matter. What matters is to me. Basically, I love you. I appreciate you. You're amazing. You're awesome. I'm proud of you. Look at those birds back there. I'll see if I can, oh, you see them? I'll see if I can see them, get a little closer. But those are affirmations for myself to help heal myself from my past traumas and stop focusing on the negativity. And where I do that is in nature. It's my son's 18th birthday yesterday and I wasn't with him because I had to take care of my own mess. A mess I created long ago. And that's how I'm working on cleaning up. I used to run around in swamps like this when I was a kid. This is what helps keep me grounded. Most people wouldn't walk through this for fear of snakes and alligators. And again, I've been doing this my whole life. I'll take you on tours of the swamp if you want. Charge you money. Be respectful. This old poison ivy right there. I didn't need to do that, but I love this machete. It's cool. It's an old tree. Just sit in there. She really respect nature. You know what? I'll show you what I have in my pockets real quick so I don't make this a long video. Got a little bit of string. I also have a string in the back there. I have a pen. I have ear pods so I can listen to my pot audio thing as I'm sitting on the phone with child support. Pink. Here's a reason I have a lighter. I don't smoke. But you know what? If I need to light a fire, I've got one. I've got another knife. I've got a battery pack for my phone since I'm calling child support in Florida. Got my wallet with a little owl on it because it's wisdom. May not seem like it, but I do have a lot of wisdom. <laughs> Whoops. 
everything I need is right here literally right here I can survive out here with that <clears throat> along with that fish hook that's on top of my hat and this is my son's hat Tyler I love you happy 18th birthday I'm gonna put this stuff back in my pockets but I can literally survive out here on what I have in my pockets a pen you know how important it is to have something to write with you can write on your arm if you ever have to put a tourniquet on which I can use this for I can write on my arm exactly what time I put it on just gonna stuff all this stuff in my pockets I'll organize it later and I'll keep walking a little bit more if you get hurt out here How are they going to find you? Chances are they're not. So you have to be self-sufficient. As a cave diver long ago, technically I still am. I don't have any of my gear left. But this, I have air, I have resources, I have everything I need right here. People say cave diving is dangerous. It's not if you're properly trained. This isn't dangerous if you're properly trained and you have the right resources and you know what things are and you respect nature. I can build a hammock. There's so many things that I can do back here. Check out the cypress. Beautiful trees. And they cut them down like nothing. You walk through the middle like this. Because typically, there's not much in the middle. Snakes like to hide in little cracks and crevices. There may be a gator in the middle. But he hears me coming, and he will get out of the way, or not. If I step on him, I have this to literally push him away. He'll strike at you, he'll do everything. But they're just being themselves. I'm more in tune with this out here that I am with the evilness of people. I know what to expect out here. Mosquitoes, water, tannin. <laughs> Literally. The, the only thing really to fear out here is getting an infection. getting so badly hurt that you disappear. But you know what? If I ever go, not that I want to, I'd love to be out here in nature. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. People think we're so important. Our egos are so big, but really, we live and we die. Just like this tree. Nobody cries over that tree. We've all lost a lot of things in life. I've lost my parents, heck, my cousin. I just lost my uncle. And it's hard right now, the pain hurts. 
but time does heal. And there's a reason for everything. There's a reason for everything. We just have to cherish the memories that we've had. Saw a guy with the uh, Mexican tattoo, the Day of the Dead. Perfect little seat. I can turn that into a bed if I wanted to. We have to remember who we are. Remember why we're here. I'm using TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and all that stuff to get out a message. Get out a message that our system sucks but we still have to adhere to the rules of our system till we choose to change it. The only way you can change it is if you change yourself. That's food right there. Medicine. Literally everything's out here that we need everything don't take my word for it do your own research don't start eating stuff based on what you saw on YouTube and what you think don't come walking out here if you don't know what you're doing you'll get lost and hurt don't know what to do oh look at that up there These are called air plants. They have a particular scientific name. Somebody else can figure that out for me. There's one there. But look at what caught my eye. That one, let's see if I can get it. Right there. Sure they have some sort of medicinal purposes. Look, I'm, I'm up to my knees. Bam, see it up there? Those plants I used to uh come back here into a swamp just like this and collect them for my mom. Here's another one. Right there. That other one up there is blooming. And you can see the pink. Or not. I don't really care. <coughs> Anyways. video is 13 minutes long. That's long enough. I'm going to get back on the phone with the DMV, sit on hold for them, or with them for another however long, or child support, sorry. Pirate Brian, Captain Brian, Handyman Brian, literally everything Brian, Healing Brian. I love you. I respect you. You're amazing. I don't like some of your habits and some of the things you do, but you're amazing. Again, those words are for me and my sons, Tyler and Dylan, my niece and nephew, Naomi and Nathaniel. That's our legacy. Cardi Creations.